Disney World Book Day. So one of my favourite books is A Thousand Splendid Sons by Khalid Husseini. Um, this book was just amazing. It took me on a journey of a character called Mariam and how she became this really strong female going through all the hardship that she did, inspired by um, another character called Layla. Um, just, it was just an emotional roller coaster of a book. I know that sounds like a very cliche thing, but genuinely, uh, uh, it was just, I was in that world. And when I closed the book, it felt like a part of my, a chapter in my own world had ended because I was so immersed in that story. You'd have to read it to know what I was talking about. It really is just an all time favorite of mine and you'd be missing out if you didn't pick it up. Okay, bye, thank you. One of my favourite books is The Hobbit by J.R.R. Tolkien. It's about someone very ordinary going on an extraordinary adventure full of danger and mystery and strange creatures. Uh, I used to read this. Um, my dad read it to me when I was little. This book is very old and now I read it to my children. It was made into a film. Um, it's the story before The Lord of the Rings. Um, the film is really good as well, but as always, the book is better. Hello, you might think my third book is a French book. But no, it's actually a novel written by Emily Bronte called Wuthering Heights. You might have heard about that book already, as it's one of the landmarks in British literature. It has been written in 1847, and it tells a story of two families, but mainly two characters, called Catherine and Heathcliff. The story takes place in the West Yorkshire Moors. Their story represents... Human nature as its darkest, but also represents the fatal and selfish side of love. Emily's Bronte's words were so intense that I decided to go and see where the book was written. And when I went there in Haworth, it was just as if I entered the book and was going to meet the characters. The way I felt on that day will remain with me forever. And I wish you find a similar book that will bring you the same kind of emotion. Reading is such a fun thing to be able to do. Yes, it's brilliant for all your lessons and stuff, and it will help every subject that you do, but also you can escape into other worlds. You can explore different lives and find out what it's like to be different people. And it's something that you can escape into wherever you happen to be. <laughs> This was my favourite book at school. I probably read it first when I was 14 or 15. It is The Three Musketeers by Alexandre Dumas, a French author. It's one of the most famous adventure stories of all time. It's been made into many, many films, uh, one or two of which you may have seen. You really shouldn't be put off by the fact that it is a, uh, an older classic book. It's really easy to follow. The story rips along really, really quickly. It's got some great characters in and I think you would enjoy it very much. <laughs>